Okay, so what else is different about um, IST? Never mind the papers. I'm getting the most positive feedback about the menus. We're changing the menus at the symposium. This is Amy Landis's idea, and I can say it was Amy Landis' idea because uh, so many people so far have decided that they like it. The default menu is vegetarian, and it's not spaghetti vegetarian. This is Beth Schaefer, who's helping us coordinate the conference. She uh, called up the Marriott and said, we want a couple of things from you. One of the things that we want is we want to make sure there is no bottled water anywhere near our participants. They can drink the tap water from the pitchers. I see somebody's enjoying that fine Cincinnati uh, Public Works uh, water right now. The other thing that we want is we want the default menu. This is Thursday's lunch menu, and by the way, it looks delicious. We want it to be vegetarian. They sent back a bunch of pasta dishes, and Beth said, that's not good enough for our crowd. They don't have these vegetarian dishes on the menu. Beth sent them a menu of her favorite vegan restaurant in San Francisco. And she said, these are the kinds of things that you should be making for us. She had an extensive conversation with the chef. And the chef was like, hey, that's a good idea. <laughs> then I said, but Beth, we must, you know, my son, he's 17. He lives on nothing but hamburgers. We must, you know, accommodate the, there must be an opt out, right? If you want meat, you can have meat and we will accommodate you so far. Three people are going to eat chicken. I think that's great. Had, eat, you know, th what you like. But what we discovered is that this is straight out of the nudge book. People will just sort of go along with what the default is. And what we have for a default at this conference is delicious. So enjoy Thursday. That's to Beth's credit.